When a child is abducted abroad by one parent, there is in reality little the other can do to get them back. Sean Felton from Cannock wants the government to take the problem more seriously and has a petition signed by thousands who share his concerns. He's walking the length of the Grand Union Canal to hand deliver it to Downing Street. Why walk to Downing Street? Why not just put it in the post or take the train? Because nobody would listen to me. Everybody has got to know about why we're doing this walk. There's over 500 children a year being taken out of the UK. His own son, Joe, was one of those 500 children in 2010, snatched by his ex-wife and taken to her native Thailand. Neither local police nor Interpol nor the Foreign Office were any help. Child abduction is worse than death. When someone dies, you grieve. When someone's missing and you don't know where they are, you don't know whether they're alive, dead, you can't comfort them. It's an ongoing pain. Posing as a wealthy American and befriending her on Facebook, Sean tracked his ex to a remote village near the Burmese border. He found his two-and-a-half-year-old boy in the corner of a wooden hut six months after he'd last seen him. In his case, it wasn't just child abduction, there was also some child abuse. There was a child abuse. He was, he got his thumbnail ripped out, his teeth had been broken and he got bruises up his back. He wasn't speaking Thai, he wasn't speaking English, he was confused, he was jibber jabber. He was a bit feral, he was a bit wild. I slept with him on the sofa for a long, long time, six months. He was nightmares, weeing. It's the girls that you can't help them. It's the girls that my child was in danger. I don't know where else he went through. I don't know where he endured, I don't know where he experienced. Sean has been to London before to demand politicians pay more attention to the many cases like his. It was only through his own efforts and expense that he got Joe back. One charity that monitors child abduction says the government's own data over the past decade show a rise, but probably fall far short of reality. Last year, the Foreign Office uh, indicated that there's been an 88% increase in the number of children that have been abducted out of the United Kingdom in the last 10 years. However, a lot of cases are not reported, and I think it is much more than any of those statistics tell you. And for the hundreds of British parents left behind, the battle to get their children back is a much longer and lonelier road than it should be. That's the message Sean Felton is carrying. He's due to arrive at David Cameron's front door next Tuesday. Callum Watkinson, ITV News.